Ready, Cosmo? Ready, Wanda. One, two, three! Wakey, wakey, Jimmy! Oh, come on, little fella. Even though we're your fairy godparents, we don't need our magic to tell us that you're in for a boring, ordinary day of school. Yippee. And that's why I'm scared of the big ramp. So you and your friends pay to fall on your face at the skateboard park? <laughs> Someone's coming quick. I wish you guys were my skateboard gear. <laughs> His whole face hit at the same time. He must be really good. Is your dentist buy you tickets to this place? Yeah. Why? Darn it. All right, you guys, watch and learn. I like to learn. Wow! Wow! I've never been this good before. Well, sweetie, you've never had magic skate gear before. Wow, look at take me roll nimbly back and forth. I mean, shred. Wow, she really has a thing for Timmy. Well, sure, he's the bomb. I read that in a teen magazine. Let's play Timmy and Tootie in the jungle home. You're me, and you're Timmy! Cool, I'm the bomb. Mwah, mwah. I love you, Tootie. Mwah, 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 mwah. Hey, I like this game. Man, this TV show sure is boring. Guess what boring movie we rented? The boring dog who could shoot boring hoop. Detective Ryan McCain is a loose cannon cop who doesn't play by the rules in... Loose cannon cop who doesn't play by the rules. <laughs> Egad, in my advanced state of lethargy, I must have grabbed something interesting by mistake. Come on, guys, can we watch it? Please, please, please! Wow, this movie is violent and stupid. I know, I'd have settled for just one. and toilet paper in my costume stinks. I'm ready, I'm willing, and I'm, uh... Totally absorbent. Right, Cosmo. Mm -hmm. Cosmo, Wanda, what are you guys doing? If anybody sees you with me, you'll have to go away forever. Timmy, it's okay. It's Halloween. Everybody's wearing a costume. Yeah, nobody will know we're fairies. This year, I'm going as a floating human janitor. And I'm a floating human nurse. Who floats? And I'm the Wicked Witch of Where's My Candy? Start begging! And Chompy, whose quick thinking saved our town from a raging fire. <laughs> Yay, Chompy! And now, behold the living glory that is Chompy the Goat. That's him? What's the big deal? He's just a smelly old goat. Who said that? How dare you minimize the importance of Chompy? The rest of you can head off to the Chompy the Goat gift shop. Because it looks like somebody needs a little alone time with our goat hero. <laughs> See ya, twerp. Go! Thank Chompy's forgiveness! Wow! Timmy's won another game of Timmy Ball! That's the first rule in Timmy Ball! Timmy wins! I thought there were no rules in Timmy Ball! Well, that's the second rule! Run! <laughs> you can't go in there! That's Dr. Bender's yard! So? Dude, didn't you see the lightning and hear the weird music? All of a sudden, it's nighttime? Don't you understand? He's a dentist! And mean! He's a mean dentist! Wow! Look at the size of this tooth! Hey, my ball! Ow! Oh, hello! Is this your ball on my lawn and your ankle in my trap? Uh, uh... Wow! Is that short for... Oh, gosh! My teeth are hideous! May I please just have my ball back? Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, no! Only boys with perfect teeth like mine can have a ball as fun as this. And who has teeth as good as yours? May I present to you and your big silly teeth, my son, Wendell. Here you go, Wendell. Wow, this sure is a fun ball that's mine now. Your teeth are 
aren't so great. Well, Bucky the Bucktooth Tooth Boy, that's where you're wrong. Both I and my son have perfect teeth. My comb has perfect teeth. And even our dog is on its way to good oral perfection. Nice catch, Cosmo. Thanks. Can I be a bat now? Go for it. Yay! Thanks for helping me warm up, guys. Thanks for letting us come to your Little League game today, Timmy. Yeah! I love baseball! What's the name of your team? The Losers. How'd you get that name? Ow! Owie! Ow! Oh, Chunky! Who are you guys playing today? The Burlingville Overactive Thyroids. Hard to believe those kids are ten. <laughs> Christmas Eve, my parents are out shopping, and I'm stuck here with Vicky. But it's worth it, because tomorrow's Christmas. The greatest day ever! Incoming! That's the last one! Who are all these gifts for? Nobody! I just like making you work! Merry Christmas, Timmy! We're ho-ho-home! <laughs> oh, I'm in the spirit. Uh, you're ten, sweetie. You're not that hard to figure out. Oh, no! Francis is coming. You two gotta hide. I wish that you looked like school kids. All right, Turner. It's time to... Hey, where'd Turner go? Uh, brown hair, big teeth, short kid, uh, silly pink hat. Yeah! Never, Never heard, heard of him. him. <laughs> well, when you see him, Tell him I'm going to give him my special year-end punch, or I'll give it to you. Oh, cool. I love presents. Now that's one angry puppy. I can't sleep in my own bed. I didn't know being an adult would be so hard. Oh, it's okay, sweetie. Tomorrow will be better. Really? We don't know. Owie! Ouch! Ow! Cut it out, Francis. That's my only head. <laughs> Finally, this looks like a job for... Older Timmy! Pluck on somebody your own size. Merry <laughs> 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 Grandpa Cosmo and Wanda. I'm Cosmo and Wanda. Now that your kid is big and hairy, your next assignment is mean and scary. Man, wish I had some fairy godparents to knock around instead of this stupid doll. Whoa, that fell off. Awesome! You mean we're being reassigned? <laughs> I mean, uh, yes, and we're all very sorry. Can we have a couple of hours to say goodbye to Timmy? Can I have five dollars? Two hours. What's going on? You said you just couldn't grant me any more wishes. I didn't know you'd have to leave me, too. We didn't know that either. Apparently, the other thing I'm chock full of is not knowing stuff. Hey, what if I acted like a kid again? I could wish myself back to normal and you guys wouldn't have to leave. Hmm, I don't see anything that says you can't. I smell loophole. We'll discuss it at the next fairy convention. Come on, Timmy. Oh, let's find your inner child. Miniature golf is a great kid's game. Ow, my back! Let me try the age o meter. Kid, adult. Oh, no! You've become even more of an adult! We've got to resort to the heavy artillery! <laughs> That's just plain creepy. Time to go! Can we have two more hours with Timmy? Can I have five more dollars? Come on! We gotta get me younger. I'm running out of fives. Have you seen this twerp? 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 Vicky! I've never been so happy to see you in my... Actually, I've never been happy to see you. You are one creepy adult. We got a place for guys like you. Home? Oh, sweetie, we tried. Look at it this way. Meals don't cost $265 here. 
One phone call, creep. Mom, it's me, Timmy. Honey, it's some old guy calling me from jail. He says he's Timmy. That's creepy and inaccurate. We know that Timmy was taken to school by his loving babysitter, Vicky. They didn't believe me. I don't want to be grown up. <laughs> I don't know about this, guys. Oh, don't be nervous, Timmy. You're going to have the best show and tell day ever. Trust us. Yeah. How many other kids have fairy godparents that can magically produce an extinct polywolliaptosaurus? It was my idea. No, it was my idea. Well, it was my idea to take your idea. Ah! It was her idea. Oh, boy. The 595th Annual Dimsdale Camelot Festival, where you get to dress up and act like people from the Middle Ages. Cool! I'm middle-aged. You kids get off my lawn! No, I mean the long-ago time of knights and dragons and wizards. This shall be most awesome. But I'm gonna need the best knight costume ever. Come, let us sally forth into yonder fear! <laughs> Whoa, actual dinosaurs actually fighting! Way cool! And there's the comet that wipes them all out! Ah, uh, if the comet didn't kill the dinosaurs, what did? How about Sylvester Calzone? You're the species, I'm the extinction! Tire, please. You are planning on shaving that beard, right? Hey, come on, let's take a look around old Dimsdale. Actually, we're in ye old town with no name. Well, they should call it the town with no hygiene. Low grades, health report. Look at all the cheese he ate in fourth grade. No wonder he was constipated that entire year. And here's a photo from his last parent-teacher's conference. Holy food stamps! Those aren't Timmy's parents. You're right. That guy with green hair looks way smarter than Timmy's dad. Here they are in a three-legged race, picking him up from school. And here they are backstage with Siegfried and Roy. No way! Those tickets are impossible to get. I know, I've tried. There's only one logical explanation. Come on! Timmy Turner? We know your secret. What? We know you got rid of your real parents and used the insurance to buy the internet and these pink and green replacement parents. We're on to you. I'm gonna give you, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? My pay? Ah, oh, oh, it's too painful. Just take it. Can I have a minute to say goodbye? Goodbye, money. Wow, this is just enough money to buy a VQ. <laughs> Ah, oh, well, pack the parkers, kids! Hey, what gives? Well, you just wanted to play until you got the money for your V-Cube, remember? You gotta make me freakishly huge again! Tonight's the big game! Ah, uh, Timmy, we can't, remember? I wish I was freakishly huge and talented at basketball. Ow! At least until I make enough money for a new V-Cube. Then I never want to be this freakishly huge again. I have got to be less specific with these wishes. Well, all we can hope for is that your lessons and sharing will spur the bull hogs on to victory. And if not, who wants to try my blubber nuggets? Mmm! <laughs> They're chewy! Uh, everyone! Run to the safe bosom of the United States educational system! <laughs> until I get my nuts. Ah! Or until I can feel my legs. But why would I want to go back to being a dog? <laughs> oh my gosh! Timmy and Timmy are fighting! You know, Lollipop, when we were apart, I was so lonely. Oh no! Timmy just bit Timmy! Timmy this, Timmy that. You're lucky I'm not the jealous type. That's it! <laughs> 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 Hi there, big boy. Hi, I'm Doido. You're a pretty poodle. I like pretty.
pretty poodles. I was just looking for the right dog to give this big, juicy bone to. Hi, I'm the real Doidle. No, I'm Doidle. You're not a dog. You're just a boy with a silly pink hat. I am not. I wish I was a dog again. Cool. I'm human. I'm human. I'm not an animal. In your face, dog. Here, see the ball, doggy? Well, fetch. <laughs> you really think my hat is silly? <laughs> Sorry, I'm happily married. I wish I was ignored. Timmy, you might want to choose your wishes carefully. Done! Thanks, guys. Guys? Oh, uh, guys! Guys! We're ignoring Timmy in France? <laughs> and you said the escape pod to Paris was a bad idea. 